。好，咁我哋今堂學啲咩呢？就係、是、誒點、呃、樣學好英文寫作嘅二最難搞嘅 verb。咁點解話 verb 係最難搞呢？咁因為喺過往嘅教學經驗裏面咧，咁我發覺誒好、呃、多香港嘅學生咧都會將一啲 verb 咧係搞到亂晒大龍。咁、呃、譬如話可能佢哋即係中學嘅時候或者小學嘅時候，好多時都學過誒、嗯、一啲譬如話 irregular verbs 啊、regular verb 啊，或者係誒、嗯、其他嘅動詞種類啦，可能係 transitive verb 啊、intransitive 啊、auxiliary verb 啊等等所有嘢。咁當佢哋學嘅時候咧，但係又可能係一知半解，或者係佢哋理解得唔係好清楚，咁所以咧好多時咧就會將佢哋搞到亂曬大龍。咁我今次咧就係、是、想將大家嘅以前一路積落嚟嗰啲淤血咧係清咗先。咁因為其實 verb 咧係可以分好多種，可能係分分鐘，睇下先。有時起碼至少五至六種嘅 verb 㗎。咁同埋中間都有好多嘅變化，因應好多嘅情況係有唔同嘅改變。咁所以咧，其實你首先第一樣嘢、呃，第一樣淤血你要清嘅咧，就係、是、verb， 你要搞清楚所有嘅 verb 嘅種類啦，同埋係點樣用嘅。咁第一種咧，其實、呃、我諗最基本咧 ，verb 係有兩種啦。咁喺一個句子裡面咧，最主要係有 main verb。咁呢個我哋中文咧係叫做一個主要動詞。咁啊，主要動詞裏面咧，其實都分好多種嘅，基本上。咁啊，第一種咧，其實就係叫做 regular verb 啦，即係我諗得到。咁呢個咧就叫誒規則動詞。咁咩為之規則動詞咧？就即係話佢佢個 verb 後面咧，如果佢將佢轉做一個過去式嘅話，咁我哋係純粹加 ed 嘅啫。OK， 咁有啲咩例子啦？譬如話 listen 啦，我哋。將佢轉 past tense 嘅時候咧，其實其實就咁將佢加 ed 就得啦。咁又或者譬如 play 啦。加 ed 啦，跟住 cook 啦，加 ed 系 cooked 啦，系嘛？咁跟住，譬如话另一个字 finish， 加 ed 就系 finished， 咁啊好简单嘅啫。咁啊，但系另一种咧就系、是、叫做 irregular verb。咁可能以前咧啲即系你哋嘅各位啦吓，即系以前小学嘅时候都成日都念书噶啦吓。咁啊要即系老师通常咧就要嚟啊念诶、嗯，即系啲 irregular verb forms 嘅和 past tense， 跟住 past 诶，跟住。present participle 跟住 past participle 即係加 ed 咁樣，咁啊三個 column 啦係咁背背背咁樣，咁啊其實就係呢一種啦。咁中文呢個叫乜嘢咧？就係、是、叫不規則動詞。咁點解叫不規則咧？就話當你將佢轉做一個 past tense 嘅時候咧，你要轉 form 嘅。OK，past、okay, tense 你要轉 verb form。係啦，咁呢種咧就係、是、我哋所講嘅 irregular verb。咁有啲咩例子咧？咁啊，又俾啲例子俾大家先啦。咁譬如話 eat 啦，個過去式咧係 ate， 過去分詞咧係 eaten。OK， 咁跟住另外譬如話 write 啦，咁過去式就係 wrote 啦，過去分詞 written。teach 啦，咁有啲同學咧好得意，我曾經見過有啲學生咧。誒、uh, 比較低程度嗰啲，佢哋會以為咧個 past tense 係就咁加 ed teach， 咁其實就唔係嘅，咁應該係 taught， 咁啊過去分詞就係 taught 啦。另外譬如話 run 啦，佢個過去式咧係 ran， 過去分詞係 run， 都係讀 run 嘅，係啦。咁另外 swim 啦，過去式 swam swam， 咁呢啲係好簡單例子。咁我諗相信即係如果你咧，其實你打開字典，其實你任何一本可能誒。Um, 我諗大型嗰啲啦，佢通常會係即係 show 到俾你睇，其實係有啲 irregular verb form 裏面咧，其實係有啲誒、嗯，即係有個整個動詞表咁樣俾你背咁樣嘅，係啦。咁所以咧，其實你最緊要就係話，你寫句子嘅時候，你首先搞清楚，最主要依兩隻先。咁當然仲有其他嘅，咁譬如話誒、嗯、第三種啦，應該話誒、嗯、呢種咧應該可以講就係 verb form。咁呢個係咩呢？就話、是、動詞嘅形態，咁佢呢就係、是、會因應呢個 tenses 咧，誒、嗯，咁我諗呢個呢就係、是、話你係會根據誒唔、呃、同嘅 tenses 咧係轉 form 嘅，即係話根據唔同嘅時態呢，佢係會轉咗唔同嘅形式。咁譬如話好簡單啦，咁如果我哋係喺個 simple present tense 裏面嘅話呢。咁通常咧，我哋譬如話個 subject 佢係單數嘅 singular 嘅 ，OK。咁俾個例子俾大家，譬如話 she likes eating ice cream
咁好簡單啦嚇。She likes eating ice cream。咁你見到咧個動詞啦 ，like 啦呢個字，佢後面咧加 s 嘅係咪？咁點解咧？就因為佢呢個係一個 singular 嘅 subject。OK， singular subject。咁所以咧，我哋成日以前咧，因為譬如話誒第三新單數要加 s， 咁就係呢一件事啦。OK， 咁所以呢一度咧就係要加 s 嘅。OK， 好啦，咁但係如果中數係點咧？咁啊，譬如話 they like eating ice cream， 咁啊佢一犯三啦。咁譬如話你見到呢、這個個 they 咧，佢係中數嘅 plural 嘅，係嘛 plural subject。咁所以後面咧佢係一定唔需要加 s 咯。OK， 咁呢個好簡單，但係好多時咧，我見而家就算可能去到大專嘅學生咧，好多時即係未必嗰啲 subject 啦，係 he she it 咁簡單，可能係一啲比較比較複雜嘅句子，譬如好似呢一句，啊、uh, Um, 譬如好似呢一句咁樣啦。Okay, the budget plan 2011 has been severely criticised. 好啦，咁譬如好似呢一句咧，有時有啲同學咧，即係可能呢句或者都未未係最深啦，可能或者再靜心啲，譬如話誒、uh, ，which was announced. Um. 好啦。當呢度整個 subject 係咁長而又個 subject 係好似同嗰個 verb 係隔開咁遠嘅時候咧，佢就開始嚟了啦。佢就開始咧係會亂曬大陸。咁所以去到呢啲位嘅時候咧，其實就算係一個 simple present tense 咧，都會搞到亂曬大陸嘅。咁所以其實就係話誒，依、呃這個又牽涉到另一個問題啦，牽涉到就係一個 agreement 嘅問題。OK， 咁所以其實誒、uh, verb form 啦，同埋嗰個 agreements 咧，即係話個 subject 同埋個 verb 之間嗰個配搭咧，其實都會牽涉在內咯。嗯，咁除咗 present tense 之後，咁跟住之後，當然我哋就係一個 simple past tense 咯，係嘛？好啦，咁但係如果 simple past tense 嘅話，咁其實最簡單啦，呢、這個咧就一定係要轉 form。正如我頭先咁講啦，就係話如果你係 irregular verb 嘅話咧。就要將佢轉做一個 past tense 嘅 verb form， 咁譬如頭先我都講 eat 會轉做 ate 啦 ，write 轉做 wrote 等等諸如此類，咁呢啲應該大家都識噶啦。咁跟住去到就係 perfect tense 啊、嗯，誒，咁呢個咧，譬如話 present perfect 或者 past perfect 都好啦嚇。咁呢個咧其實佢 verb form 就一定係要 has。啊，或者係淨係講呢一個先啦。Present perfect tense， OK， 咁依個咧就一定係 has 或者 have 加一個 verb 嘅 past participle。好啦，咁例子有咩咧？譬如話頭先最簡單咧 ，has eaten 啦 ，have written 啦 ，has taught 啦 ，have 誒 has has 或者 have run。Whatever, OK， 好啦，咁呢啲咧其實你會見到啦，就係、是、你 order 係用 has 或者 have 啦，咁但係幾時用 has 定 have 咧？咁呢個亦都係同翻頭先所講啦，就係、是、牽涉翻個 agreement 嘅問題，即係話你究竟係單數啊定係眾數咁樣嘅 ，OK， 咁啊整兩個例子啦，嗯，好簡單啦，咁又或者係 he has。好啦，類似啲咁嘅低能句子啦嚇 ，We have finished washing the dishes， 或者 He has eaten all the ice cream 咁樣啦。OK， 咁所以咧，其實基本上主要嘅動詞咧都係分最基本係兩種啦。咁第一種就係 irregular verb 啦 ，regular verb 同埋另外誒、呃、要轉 form 嘅。OK， 咁當然仲有其他嘅分類，咁我哋下次咧先至再講啦。